So what I really love about this dish, it's just a really great midweek go-to when you don't have much time to prepare dinner. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to make a super easy fish finger taco. This one is ready on the table in less than 20 minutes, and it's my favorite go-to when my friends rock up unannounced. The first thing we're gonna do is preheat our oven to 220 degrees Celsius. Now I'm going to line my baking tray with some baking paper. I'm just gonna arrange my fish fingers in a single layer so they cook nice and evenly. What I like about these fish fingers is that they only take 12 to 14 minutes to cook, so super convenient, and they get nice and crispy, so they have a lovely crunch and everybody seems to love them. Next, I'm gonna sprinkle my fish with some of the seasoning from the taco kit. You can really smell the paprika, the cumin, very synonymous with sort of Mexican traditional flavors. I'm gonna use the other half of the seasoning at the end just to add more flavor and really bring these tacos to life. Turn them over so you're coating both sides of the fish fingers. I'm just gonna give them a little bit of a shimmy and pop them in the oven. It's been about six minutes and I'm just gonna turn them over so they get nice and crispy. These smell delicious. <laughs> and back in the oven we go. My fish fingers are almost done. The way I like to heat up my tortillas is in a pan, it's nice and quick. Just about less than a minute on each side until they are golden and heated all the way through. So when cooking the tortillas, you'll notice some little blistering and bubbles. That's when you know to turn them. It only takes about half a minute to a minute. So make sure you're always standing by the pan so they don't overcook. So our last tortilla is done. I'm just gonna pop them in a tea towel. Not only does this keep them nice, warm and steamy, but it makes them really easy to fold. The fish fingers are done. I'm just gonna set them aside. Now I'm just gonna prepare the Mexican style salad kit. It's made up of a crunchy blend of lettuce, carrot, cabbage, and it comes with tasty cheese for some extra flavor. So it's super convenient. And it also comes with a delicious Mexican chipotle mayo dressing, which adds a nice level of smokiness to our tacos. There we go. Make sure all of the slaw is nice and coated. That's all mixed up. I'm just gonna set it aside whilst I prepare my cherry tomatoes and my avocado. These add a really nice pop of sweetness to our tacos. And then all I'm gonna do is just slice up my avocado into some thin pieces. Great, we've got our ingredients ready. And now's the fun part. It's time to pull these bad boys together. I've got my tortilla. I'm going to pop in some of the delicious Mexican style slaw. This is great, it's crunchy, so it adds a lot of texture and a nice bit of lightness and freshness to our taco. Next up, I'm gonna add in our hero, which is our fish fingers. These look nice and crunchy and lovely and caramelized, so I'll just pop those in there. And then we'll add in our avocado, cherry tomatoes for some sweetness, the salsa that I got from the Mexican style taco kit. And then lastly, I'm just gonna sprinkle some of the seasoning for some spice and flavor to really tie it all together. Now it's taste test time, but I'm also a bit of a grot when I eat, so I'm just gonna try my best not to get this on my lovely dress. Bear with me. Mm. I love the texture of the taco. The fish is lovely and crispy and crunchy, but it's also a really neutral flavor profile, so it's a really family-friendly recipe. 